all of us are Arjuns, caught in their own flesh, in their blood, in their tears, in their emotions, in their past, and being caught, we forget what our dharma is. Therefore, Bhagavad Gita is immortal. As long as Arjun lives within us, we will continue to need Krishna. What I notice with myself is that uh, having thoughts uh, prevents me from listening with attention. Uh, yeah, there are some messages that say, uh, say to your thoughts, eh, leave, go away. Mm. What, what's your opinion about Don't it? Don't say even that much. But is it just being conscious of the thoughts? Don't that? even be conscious of the thought. Because whatever you are with respect to the thought is just a furtherance of the thought. Don't even look at the thought. And when I say don't even look at the thought, I would amplify it by saying that don't even don't look at the thought. And then I would amplify that by saying don't even don't even don't look at the thought. But when the thought is there, it, it, there is no listening with attention. We see that the thought is not there unless you know that the thought is there. Is the wall there? Yeah, only, only you can see it. Yeah. Yeah. The wall is there only when? when yeah. I'm aware of the wall. Is the, car, at it. Yeah. is the car there? Ultimately, what matters is, is it there for you? Yeah. Let the thought not be there for you. The thought is there for you only when you think that the thought is going to help you. It is never without reason <coughs> that we nourish thought. Never without reason. Mm. We have a certain hope associated with thought. We think thought is useful. Yeah, but maybe it's a thought that I think I miss something when I don't listen with yes, attention. Yes, yes. If you live in a certain faith that you are already all right mm -hmm. and that nothing would go wrong if you do not think, then there would be no energy left in any of your thoughts. What do you think? Thoughts are not ready to rise here. Here they are. Yeah, yeah. But I am so very committed to some other space. And I'm playing there and I'm enjoying there. I have no time, no energy, no space, no inclination to know those thoughts, let alone do anything about them. Even if I say that I will tell the thoughts to go away. Even if I say that I am not going to touch the thoughts, yeah. it means that I am conscious of the thoughts and that has spoiled it all. Then you already and touched that it. Is, then you have already touched it. They go. No, they don't go. No, I mean the, you say you are conscious about the thoughts? The moment you are conscious about the thoughts, the fact of consciousness is feeding the thoughts, oh, is inflating okay. the thoughts. Mm -hmm. okay. mm -hmm. And this too is a very popular myth. There are teachers who keep suggesting that you must not do such things with thoughts. You must not do these things with thoughts. You must not do... Yeah. By not doing anything or something with thoughts, you have already done a lot. <laughs> now what more can you do? <laughs> they don't realize this. No. They don't realize that both doing and not doing are acts of the ego. They are both doing. So the thought, they are both doing. They are both doings. So the, 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 the I, the, the, the me that is thinking, that's the thought, is the, the problem, so to say. Your support to that thought is the problem. Yeah. Yeah. And your support to thought comes from your lack of faith in the total. Call it God, call it truth. Ah, uh, yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, you need something to rely on. And if mm. you do not rely on God, you will rely on thought. Wow! Can you repeat it again, okay. please? Okay. If you don't rely on God, you rely on thought. On thought. Yeah. Oh, yeah.
which is simply to say that if you don't think the universe is taking care of you you'll be compelled to take care of yourself and it is so much there in the west is it not i must take care of myself how can i leave myself to chance i must be the one who provides for himself we never say let it come let it come i was not born out of my planning i do not breathe out of my planning i'll also probably not die out of my planning this body that i think myself to be does not operate as per my planning then why must i try to govern life as per my planning we don't say that we feel unless we take care of ourselves we will be ruined destroyed as you say you know i'll go to dogs you never wonder are the dogs really interested in you <laughs> we behave as if the dogs are dying to have us <laughs>